What's up, YouTube? We got some Star Wars Tops Galaxy 2022 Chrome box right here. Just got pretty much a case on this, so it did go in with a few people. So this is the first box opening I've done of this. I've seen a few box opening videos. Um, we had pre-ordered this product a while ago, but it just took you know a while to get here so very very excited to open this obviously the last year one i feel like i missed the boat on that um but i did get a complete refractor set of it um i don't have any other cars from that set and like a few extras um but i am very excited to open these they look like beautiful cards and i know there's some controversy with um the centering quality control on some of these um, but I know there's not as many cars and they're not referencing the artists on some of these, which is also kind of a bummer. So we're just going to go right through these. There's a nice Han Solo there. Okay. I guess these are the base cards, right? So we'll put that in the base. Uh, okay. Is that Boba Fett and Dengar? Refractor. Okay. That's a refractor. Oh, so that, that says refractor. This is just base. That says refractor. Okay, what's this one? Collect all four digital original trilogy, trilogy concept art cards. OT2. Okay, so this is Boba Fett. I like that. It's, that's silver on the outside. That's really pretty. Okay, and then Wrecker. Okay, so this must be a base card. Okay, very cool. Moving on. So we may or may not get an auto in here. I've seen some boxes with none, some with two. Uh, numbered cards, we could get, you know, one, two, or three maybe. Let's see. Looks like this is a scene right out of the garbage chute. Battle with the Dianoga. Okay. Crosshair. Ooh, that's neat. Especially with the Bad Batch stuff going on right now. That's pretty cool. And then Luke assembling his lightsaber with Vader in the background. Nice. Assembles his lightsaber. Okay. Pretty card. And Yoda and Luke Skywalker. Okay. Interesting. Beautiful art. Beautiful art. E.A. Beautiful art. Yeah, I mean, when it comes to the cards, like, when I first saw the Galaxy Chrome cards last year, I was immediately drawn to them. And I don't, I haven't been drawn to re the irregular Star Wars cards, like, that much. Because the photo stuff, the regular top stuff, doesn't really interest me. Hera Syndulla, that's a cool card. With the B-Wing in there. And we got Tech. Alright, very cool. Refractor, Darth Vader, and Obi-Wan Kenobi. Ooh, that's really pretty card. Terribly centered, but beautiful card. And Greedo. Okay. Look at that artwork. That's pretty neat. All right. Let's keep it going. I did get... Um, I did... You know, these, these boxes aren't cheap, right? So I was tempted to be like, okay, I guess $300 is relatively cheap, but I haven't really seen them for less. Although there were some moments where, oh, this is a refractor. The Emperor's Power. Ooh, that's cool as a refractor. That's pretty neat. It's interesting they call out refractor because it can be kind of difficult to tell what's a refractor and what's not. Lord Vader and his stormtroopers. Okay. Also badass looking card. And Wicket W. Warwick. Warwick. Okay. Very cool. Good cards. Good quality cards. Uh, oh, actually, we got to go to this one. This is, this is the order we're going, right? One, two, three, four. No? No, it doesn't matter. Don't matter. We're all going to open them. We're opening all of them. So no numbered cards yet, no major hits yet, but a pretty set nonetheless. I'm excited. I'll probably want to get the complete 
base set and uh, I'm hoping out of the boxes we get uh, I'll be able to do that. Wookie War Dance. Okay. Uh, what do we got here? This is pretty. Collect all the vintage Star Wars cards. Vintage Star Wars Galaxy. Okay. And well centered too. Very pretty card. Okay. Boot to Eve Classic Refractor. Let's go, baby. Anakin's Pod Racer. All right. That's pretty. And what do we got here? Bausch, Boosh, Bausch in disguise. Oh man, these are so cool. These are so cool. Yeah, I don't, I don't know if I'll do it for any rainbows or, or numbered sets with these, but it's definitely worth getting a base set, or and or a refractor set. Stormtrooper surveying the desert. Very cool. I guess I'll put these over here. And Duel on the Death Star. Cool looking card there. He walks under attack. This is a refractor. Okay. Pretty. And the Shadow of the Dark Lord. A well centered card for this one. So that's that's a good looking card. All right, we'll just grab whatever's next here. So there's 18 packs in the box and four cards per pack. All right. Han Solo and Chewbacca in the cockpit. Boba Fett battles the Sarlacc refractor. Okay. Cool. A scene for Solo. A card game of chance. Hmm. Okay. And Obi-Wan Kenobi, Ben Kenobi here, regular base card. Yeah, I'm curious, I'm always curious to see what other boxes have been cracked and, you know, what, what kind of pulls people are getting. We haven't seen any numbers yet. No autos, no numbers yet. This is pretty. The Jedi and the Princess. It's a cool scene. Right before the... Battle of Endor. You have received a base card sketch variation from the 2022 top Star Wars Chrome Galaxy. Base sketch variation. Very interesting. Not well centered, but pretty cool. Refractor, Dark Lord, and A New Hope. Oh man, look at that card. That is pretty sweet. That is a cool, cool card. And this one too. Look at the colors on this. Isla Secura. Very cool, very cool. Man, yeah, loving, loving the art on these. Definitely gonna have to get a full set. A base and or refractor, I guess. Base, hopefully I can complete the base just from what the boxes I have. If not, I should only be like one or two away. Tuscan Raider at sundown. Let's see, Star Wars X-Wing Tour of Duty B-Wing, release date 1993, gameplay galaxy art. Okay, yeah, that's, that's a throwback, 1993. Solo Investigates Refractor. Pretty, very pretty. And Leia Organa in her Bosch, Bosch disguise. Gorgeous. She is and that card. <laughs> All right, let's keep scrolling along. Yeah, I might have to, I mean, I might have to find some, ooh, I see a numbered card in here, but let's cover this. Stormtroopers Swarm Dorth Vader, and we have Omega, 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 and this is number 69 out of 75, so I don't know what, you call, what the type of refractor you call that, but it's a pretty looking card. I better put that in a sleeve before I forget. I'm going to sleeve all these, because... You know, they're just so gorgeous. Okay, all right. Omega.
not the preferred character I'd want to have numbered, but a really pretty card nonetheless. I'm going to keep that there. And, oh, we didn't finish where we were. Slave 1. It is Slave 1. Fire Spray class, sure, but it's still Slave 1. Original Concept Trilogy Art. Very cool. And we have Darth Vader number 2 here. With that, like, kind of mirror going on there. All right, so we got one hit so far. One numbered card. All right. Boba Fett ambushed. Okay. Cool. Here's another Boba Fett, the infamous Boba Fett. Refractor of the Galax a Galaxy Within Grasp. That's a cool card. I've seen some variations of that one. That's a refractor. Oh, and here's the non-sketch variation, right? The regular one of Finn. Very cool. Yeah, I like that they throw in different variations. I mean, we're going to get different types of sketch variations, different color variations, different numbered variations. Boba Fett, number 10. Luke Skywalker in action, refractor. Whoa, very cool. That's old school. That's like a throwback one right there. And well centered. Yoda. Let's see. Yoda on Dagobah. Yeah, those are definitely throwbacks. And looks like Luke's potential hand in the jar here. Medical droid. Oh, that's the prosthetic hand. <laughs> All right. How many more packs we got to go here? Oh, there's a little styrofoam under there to make the box look bigger than it needs to be. We could have just thrown in more cards. I mean, it's not like we didn't pay enough for these boxes. All right. Obi-Wan Kenobi number three. What is this throwback here? Collect all vintage Star Wars cards. It's just a regular vintage throwback card here. I guess that goes in that pile. Chewbacca Refractor. It's hard to tell the refractor difference from the base ones. Silicious B. Crum. And there's Silicious Crum. Cool. All right, we're coming down here to the last five packs. Only one numbered card so far, no autos. Is this a dud box? Is this a dud box? A Wookiee in the Wilderness. Rebel Assault 2. Oh, this card has, like, nostalgic meaning for me. This game was so much fun. The Hidden Empire. 39 out of 50. Collect all the gameplay Galaxy art cards. Yes. Let's go. This is a cool card. Oh, man. This game is so much fun. Like, I, I wish they would update this and modernize this game. This was cool. I mean, this was like at a time when there really wasn't other Star Wars going on and they had like stories going, you know, about like a sh uh, stealth ties going through. That was really cool. All right, I'll put that over there. R2-D2. And X-Wing Starfighter's Refractor. Beautiful card. Oh, man. Stellar looking card. Oh, man. I'm so excited about that. Rebel Assault 2. And it's a numbered one, nonetheless. Out of 50. Alright, so here's... I guess the base one of the Boot to Eve Classic. So we had the Refractor, and now we have the base. Stormtroopers Swarm Darth Vader Refractor. Okay. Beautiful looking card there. Oh, and we have Kersantan, Autograph, Carrie Jones as Kersantan, Authentic Galaxy Chrome Autograph. Well, that's kind of badass. 15 out of 99. And then we have this Luke Skywalker on Endor. So here's our other hit here. Kersantan. 15 out of 99. It's 
kind of badass. There are worse autos to get. <laughs> Not like a Hayden Christensen or, you know. Ewan McGregor, but, or Harrison Ford, but I'll take that. I'll take that. Chrysanthemum was cool. All right, we got Boba Fett Battles the Sarlacc. I might have seen that one already. Is this a sketch variation? Let's see, sketch variation of BV-89. Okay. Han Solo and Chewbacca in the cockpit refractor. So now we have the refractor version of that. And didn't mean to intrude base. Cool. Two more packs in this in this box. Hang in there with me. Hang in there. Right, let me get this out of the way. I'll take our last. And what is this here? Ooh, ooh, ooh. I see something pretty. Sith Trooper. Tora Doza of the Resistance. I guess base. This looks like a wave refractor. A Wookiee in the Wilderness, 75 out of 99. Pretty. And then this is Weakway Base. Okay, okay. So we have a 75, a 99, uh, let's see, 99. This is out of 50. So I think those are our hits. I'd be surprised if we got another numbered one in here. If we did, then I'd say it's a pretty solid uh, box, but I'm not banking on it. C3PO. Gameplay Galaxy Art Card. Bounty Hunter. Okay. Refractor of the actual box. So that's a beautiful card. Very cool. And this last card is Anakin Skywalker, number 100. Very cool. So overall, um, we got these two sketch variations, two vintage cards, two sketch cards, two gameplay cards. We have this Rebel Assault, 39 out of 50, purple. We have this a Wookiee in the Wilderness, 75 out of 99. We got a Kersantan Auto, Carrie Jones. Uh, 15 out of 99. And then Omega, Omega, uh, 69 out of 75. So overall, beautiful set. I can't wait to open the rest of these boxes. If you like more of these openings, be sure to check back on my channel. I'll have more of these. I also open up Star Wars CCG and Bounty Hunters, among other things of whatever comes my way, because these cards are just beautiful. Thanks for checking this out. Catch you on the flip.